Today we're gonna scan some barcodes and see what they tell us. Hey guys, it's Sam with The Blind Spot. Today we're gonna take a look at the really cool application. It's called Digit Eyes. This application, unfortunately, is only available on iOS devices, so iPhones, iPads, that sort of thing. And the app is a barcode scanning app. So it will scan the barcode and it will tell you what the product is and give you a lot of information about it. That's what's so awesome about this app. All right, we've got our iPad. We've got a can of food that we're gonna scan and find out what it is. So let's check out the app and see what it's all about. So one nice thing about this app is a very simple interface. So it works really, really well with voiceover. Here's the options we have on the main screen here. Scan, button, list, button, audio labels, button, more, button. Let's go into more real quick to see what's inside there. More, more, back, button, scanning tips, button, website, button, email support, button. Logout button. And then down at the very bottom, it tells you what version you're using here. Back. We'll back. go back. Scan button. And we will scan something here. It opens up the camera, and you might be able to hear it's clicking because it's always looking for a barcode. So we have our can here, and now I might not be able to tell where the barcode is on this can. So what I'm going to do is hold it in front of the camera at a distance here. So I'm just gonna keep turning until it sees the barcode. Looking up barcode, oh. Campbell's home style soup, Mexican style chicken tortilla, 18 dogs, six ounces can. And it found it Done. very Done. easily. So it brings up some information. It shows the barcode and it gives you the name of the product here. I'll hit it again so we can hear it. Campbell's home style soup, Mexican style chicken tortilla, 18 dogs, six ounces can. Now we have some other information on this page. More information, but record. Button. Add to list. Button. More options. Button. We'll see what's in the more options and then we'll come back. More options. Web search. Button. Report wrong description. Button. So you can look for this item on the internet with a web search or you can report that that wasn't an accurate item. Cancel. Button. Go back. Cancel. More options. Button. More information. Button. So the more information is really an important section here. It's going to give you a lot more information about the product. More information. Back. Button. Campbell's Home Style Soup Mexican Style Chicken Tortilla 18 dog 6 ounces can. Campbell's Home Style Healthy Request Mexican Style Chicken Tortilla Soup. Try me. The taste that takes you home. 140 calories. 0 0.5 grams sat fat. 3% DD. 410 milligrams sodium. 17 directions 1. Lift tab to rim. 2. Pull back slowly. Do not add water stove heat so it gives some information about the product it also gives some nutritional facts and the cooking instructions now there's also a record option here where if I wanted to record a personal note for this barcode I could do that so then every time I scan this particular barcode in the future that note will automatically play you can also add this to a list we'll jump into there real quick add to list add to list done Button, add to list, cursories, add code to new list. Now we're back at the main screen. Let's check out our lists. Lists, lists, back, button, lists, edit, button, new list, groceries, four items. So this is where all your lists will be. Let's jump into the groceries and we can take a look at some of the options. Gro groceries, lists, button, groceries, edit, button, Campbell's home style soup, Scan. Button. So you can edit this list. You can also scan a barcode to add directly to this list. Add. Button. You can add an item. The keyboard will pop up and you just type out the name of that item. Share. Button. And then you can share this list. So you can share through email or messaging. All your normal options are there. The next section is audio labels. Audio, audio labels. Back. Button. So once again, you can record custom labels to assign to barcodes, much like we did before in the previous section. But here they talk about how you can print off blank barcodes and then assign a custom recording to that. So the different possibilities that that gives you are huge. 
you could create your own custom barcodes and stick on basically anything you wanted to. I have a good friend who's totally blind, and when she buys a new pair of shoes, she'll put those shoes into a shoe box and print off a barcode for that box. Then she records a custom audio label. For example, blue high heels or red sneakers, and then assigns that to the barcode. So whenever she wants to go in and get some shoes, she just scans the barcode and knows exactly which shoes those are. Another great example, once again, the prescription medicine. All those medicine bottles are shaped exactly the same size, same way, so it's really difficult to tell them apart. But now you could put a barcode on each one and then just scan it to know what it was. Now in order to print the labels, you do have to go to the DigitEyes website. So DigitEyes, it's a really powerful application. Being able to scan those barcodes and get so much information, and then the ability to assign custom audio recordings to barcodes is just huge. So check it out, guys. I'll have a link down below. The app does cost $10. I think it's $9.99. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. This is Sam with The Blind Spot. If you like the video, be sure to hit that like button, and don't forget to subscribe to stay up to date with all the videos coming out in the future. As always, if you have any questions, please leave them down below. I'll do my best to help out. Thank you again. Sam, Blind Spot. See you next time.